The president and his motorcade left the Long Center and took a short trip over Lady Bird Lake to the Austin Music Hall. That's where a Democratic National Committee fundraiser is underway. KXA and Sophia Beausoleil live there with our top story. We are at the corner of 4th and Malaysia's where President Obama and his motorcade arrived about an hour ago. You can take a look and see where all the security detail is along Nueces, right in front of the Austin Music Hall. He's inside talking to supporters, but he was also greeted by protesters, which you can see right behind me over my shoulder, who want to have their voices heard by the president. Why not? <laughs> Why not wait? Long lines, security, and blocked off roads. Um, it has been too long. What time do we get here? It's a typical scene you would expect to see at South by Southwest, including spotting celebrities like Will I Am from Black Eyed Peas. But what's happening at the Austin Music Hall is anything but a normal event. Last chance to see him, you know? Why not? Uh, we had the opportunity to purchase student tickets, so we're very excited to come see the president in Austin. President Obama is the featured speaker at the Democratic National Committee fundraiser, a moment some say they couldn't pass. Up. This should be something everybody wants to do. This couple from Houston knew this would be their last chance to see President Obama before the end of his term. This is just a participation and, and a celebration of a successful, a successful presidency, and uh, we should all celebrate it. But not everyone agrees. <laughs> Members from United We Dream protested outside the music hall, wanting the president to take a stronger stance on deportation issues before he leaves office. The group basically wants the president to get rid of the ICE program in which local law enforcement can detain undocumented uh, people. So coming up tonight at 6, we're going to hear from protesters and what exactly they have to say. Reporting live from downtown Austin, Sophia Bosalek, KXAN News. Sophia, thanks so much. In just about an hour's time, the president will travel to another Democratic Party fundraiser at a home in Terrytown. We are told about 60 supporters will be attending the dinner at the home of Amy and Kirk Rudy. That dinner was supposed to begin around 6.20, but with the president running a little behind schedule, it may get underway a little later than planned. We will have a live report from the fundraiser coming up tonight at 6 o'clock.